Okay, also uh, we see the arrangement uh, depends on the alphabetical for the title name of each product. So that's all. Let's continue. Let's go forward to continue to add uh, the new product uh, at this storage of, or our store. Go back again to the back here. Here we see the product. Uh, we have to add um, a new product uh, by creating another product, as you see here. Also, I'm going to add um, elegant uh, woman dress. This is the the title. Here I'm going to add uh, the same text uh, to be represents at uh, this product uh, or this clothes type. Um, here we go. Organization. It will be added uh, at uh, the elegant exactly. Uh, the vendor also. It will be at Alabama store. You have to add any vendor, another collections. Exactly. I'm going to add this product to be uh, shown at the homepage. Uh, tags, uh, a Claudius, as you see here. Claudius, a dress, a woman, uh, also elegant. That's all. Let's come back uh, to the body of this product. Uh, here I'm going to I got to go to ch choose uh, the image, choose image, open, scroll down to continue. The original price, uh, it will be uh, 300. The new price uh, to be 250. Charge tax on this product, yes. It's the, it's the best user experience to be done, to be done. This is the SKU and this is the barcode number. Okay. Inventory policy should be, should be five track product. Exactly. There is a uh, 100 item only. Allow customer to purchase this product uh, when it's out of stock. No, it's not a good idea. Shipping. Uh, okay. The weight of this product, uh, one kilogram point seven. Fulfillment service manually. This product requires shipping exactly. Uh, variance, it's not variance. Uh, okay, that's all. Um, now I'm going um, to, I'm going to make save products uh, to save all of these changes. Now come back to the front end after finish um, loading. Let's go to the front end to make some refresh as you see at this moment. Here we go. Here we see this product. Uh, these, these are products, our products. One, two, three, four. I think now you see the, your store uh, comes up. Step by step, it comes up. Okay, that's, that's all. By the way, I get to change uh, the default uh, theme. I will explain uh, that on advanced uh, lecture on the next uh, of couple sections. That's all. So that's all for this um, moment. Uh, let's go to continue to add also another or additional uh, products uh, to add um, more features, to add uh, more feasibility, more proficiency, more efficiency also at your store. So let's come back again. Here I'm going to, uh, to add a new product. Uh, let's go to create another product. Here I'm going to add a women t-shirt. As you see, it's women t-shirt. Here we go. This is, um, okay, this text uh, as a demo, it's not exactly what you have to add. Okay, here is, uh, okay, it will be a t-shirt. T-shirt, okay. Add a t-shirt. Let's go to scroll down to see the vendor of Alabama store collections. Okay. We got to go at the homepage, uh, uh, tags. Um, the first tag will be, uh, sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm sorry. T-shirt. Okay. Enter. Uh, Claudius. Okay. Claudius. 
dress woman okay that's all let's continue to add uh, images upload images okay I have to add this image then make open after that I had the original price to 90 discount price is uh, 70 inventory sums SKU barcode any barcode yes here we go no track I'm going to choose a track uh, the product 2000 the weight it will be um, 3.21 okay one kilogram manually okay no variation okay let's go to save change that's all okay after uh, finishing of uh, adding all of these uh, features uh, and options add uh, these products uh, I think we had some mistakes here it's 2000 for quantity it's only okay this is the way to uh, finally uh, we have to confirm all of this information collections homepage vendor Alabama t-shirt um, this is the image this is the title woman t-shirt uh, okay let's scroll down to see woman t-shirt dress clothes okay finally we have to save changes okay let's go to the front end um, at the home page then we have to make a refresh okay at this theme only we had uh, seen four products uh, to see all products or all um, products added we have to go to catalog here we see all products add the catalog here we see the products uh, product one two three four also we have the full description of, on each product if we want by clicking on um, or on double click by on each product here we see the product full image title the quantity the, the price uh, all options uh, about this product let's uh, scroll up uh, and uh, come back again to the catalog to see what can we do here here we see we can uh, make source uh, alphabetical from A to Z or we have the ability to make browse by tags uh, when we click beach uh, also we see the products uh, which under the tag of beach uh, when we click at uh, the clothes we see all products uh, which had uh, which have the uh, tag of clothes uh, also when we click the dress we will show all products uh, has a tag of uh, dress uh, when we click uh, at elegant uh, we will show all of products uh, under elegant uh, tags when you click uh, at the jacket we will show only the product uh, had uh, jacket uh, tags also when we click at the t-shirt we will show up only the product uh, under the t-shirt when we click at the one we will show all of products uh, under woman tags that's all come back again to the home also uh, we are we have to get back to the back end um, uh, to show you uh, the latest uh, product added uh, at uh, this site of uh, Shopify store now uh, I have to go to okay uh, save changes what happens here okay we had to save okay what can we do okay okay I'm sorry uh, this message uh, okay it's okay that's all that's a quantity we have to save okay here we go that's all now let's come back again to the product uh, so these are all of about uh, products uh, our, our products sorry under a vendor with a type uh, inventory quantity at the, uh, at the inventory product name uh, images um, here we have to uh, make some changes if we want to edit or bulk or delete that's all if we want to get bulk options we have to we will see uh, different options publish selected products um, hide selection delete add tags remove tags uh, add collections remove from collections that's all 
So these are some of options um, which can we do uh, when, we, when we want that. So now let's go to add uh, the latest uh, product uh, at this section of uh, products. Uh, here I'm going to add uh, this product of, uh, with the name of t-shirt. Uh, here is the full description. Let's go to the product type. Uh, it will be a t-shirt exactly. The product type will be t-shirt um, vendor also under the Alabama store uh, collections um, at the home page. Um, let's scroll down to add um, some tags um, like um, a t-shirt. Okay, it will be um, t-shirt. It will be a uh, clothes. Okay, uh, it will be. Um, uh, dress uh, that's all okay also um, it will be for men or young okay let's uh, make uh, enter it's a new tag okay now um, here I'm going to add uh, I have to add some information